From romantic date nights with Taylor Swift to tough criticism from NFL analysts, Travis Kelsey is feeling the heat. But is Swift really to blame for Kelsey's on-field struggles, or is this just more media buzz? Stick around as we break down the drama and the real impact of this Hollywood romance. Travis Kelsey is no stranger to the spotlight, but his high-profile relationship with pop superstar Taylor Swift has sparked debate about whether his off-field life is affecting his performance on the gridiron. During the latest episode of his New Heights podcast with brother Jason Kelsey, the Kansas City Chiefs tight end openly addressed the scrutiny surrounding his NFL career. Speaking with their guest, Pat McAfee, Kelsey admitted, if we lose, it's going to absolutely rain down, baby. He added that staying on top is the key to avoiding further criticism. But despite Kelsey's concerns, McAfee, a former NFL punter turned media personality, downplayed the drama, insisting that Kelsey's relationship with Swift could only have a positive effect on the league. Still, some skeptics continue to point fingers at Kelsey's high-profile romance as a potential cause for his midseason slump last year and recent on-field struggles. It's no secret that Kelsey and Swift have been living an action-packed life away from football. From double dates with celebrity pals Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds in New York City to PDA field outings at the U.S. Open and New York Yankees playoff games, the couple has made headlines across the entertainment world. However, critics argue that Kelsey's busy offseason and relationship with Swift may have taken a toll on his NFL performance. The speculation became so intense that Swift reportedly skipped the Chiefs game against the Chargers in Los Angeles to help take the spotlight off her football ball. The whispers grew louder when NFL analyst Skip Bayless claimed that Swift was a distraction during the Chiefs' performance last Christmas. After a surprising loss to the Las Vegas Raiders, Bayless took to social media, sarcastically suggesting, feels like it's about time to call Taylor Swift a distraction. What do you think? Patrick? Andy? How about you, Travis? Other pundits, like Clay Travis, jumped on the bandwagon, even going as far as to suggest that Kelsey's struggles were tied to Swift's presence, dubbing her the Chiefs Yoko Ono. However, Kelsey and his team brushed off the criticism. Despite the midseason slump, the Chiefs ultimately triumphed, winning the Super Bowl and hoisting the Lombardi Trophy in Las Vegas this past February. And recently, Kelsey has shown he's still a force to be reckoned with, racking up 16 catches for 159 yards in his last two games, helping the Chiefs secure a 5-0 record before their bye week. The comeback has silenced many of his critics, at least for now. As Kelsey continues to balance life in the public eye with his duties on the football field, it residential to be seen whether the chatter about his relationship with Swift will die down. For now, the Chiefs' tight end seems focused on one thing winning. And if his latest performances are any indication, he's still at the top of his game, regardless of the headlines. So, what do you think? Is Taylor Swift really a distraction for Travis Kelsey? Or is this just another media storm? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more updates on the biggest names in sports and entertainment. Thanks for watching!